Hello everyone and welcome to Forza Horizon 5 for another challenge video with Purple Petrol 13 and myself, Fail Games. Today, the most expensive cars in the world. And by the world, we mean on second-hand car websites. So basically, we went on second-hand car websites, sorted by most expensive, and then took the cars into Forza Horizon 5, and we'll now put them up against a series of challenges. Hello, Petrol. Hello, I see you also have an Italian car. I see you have a... Well, very much... Out, actually, it's not that big a difference between the years, is it? In production years. 2008, this. I don't... Oh, so what six years is. does to Ooh, styling? Oh, six years? Yeah, you wouldn't... No, <laughs> it's not the Enzo doesn't look like it was 2002. It's 2000... I always thought they were 2004. I'm very confused. Wait, so that means it could have been two years. No, four, four years. years. Maths! Right, so we've got a very expensive Ferrari versus a Murcielago with an expensive body kit. Yes, or an Aventador pre-production. Yes, but for a lot more monies than an Aventador. 1.399 million, 950 to be exact. How much was yours? 1.39? Mine's double, almost. 2.7 I mean, there were more GBP. expensive cars, but they were Bugattis and very uninteresting. Basically, they were Bugattis and LaFerraris, which we'd already done the challenge in. Yes. When we did this in Horizon 4. So this is, all right, so this is actually the second most expensive car challenge. Anyway, time to see if the car named after Mr. Ferrari is himself is faster than the car named after... Whatever this is named after. People in expensive cars go to the city to show off. I know we always say that, but... Yes. But it's true. So of course we say it. So how, what better way to get to and the city fast, than with a race? To born fast. Ooh, whatever born fast oh, is. There's a man talking. Three, two, one, go. An A to B race. Fly. Oh. And understeer. Oh, I've got the racing line on. How very aesthetically unappealing. Almost as aesthetically unappealing as your car. Wow. I spent 2.7 million on this. That's <laughs> not very kind. <laughs> but does it have bat wings that come up when you go over a certain speed? No, because it doesn't look... because it's not stupid. <laughs> Goodbye. 175, just for reference. 156. Yeah. Other reference. Goodbye. About Look to pass at the 200 miles an hour. This. Mine looks awesome. It looks like an AliExpress Ferrari. This is designed after a aircraft. It's even got like a, a a radar scope thing, so I can shoot down cars in front. Wait, you're obviously failing at it because I'm pulling away massively. That is true. I don't think we ever checked how close in performance these two cars were. 857. Oh, it's going a bit faster now. It's on the runway. But so is mine. The natural home of Lamborghini airplane jets. Oh! Oh, I tried to be cool and it didn't work. The car inspired by a jet is better at flying, as it turns out. Well, I, or it was me being stupid. That's more likely. That's true. Also, now I can check that my car is indeed 818. What did I say mine was? A lot more than that. Oh, no, it's the corner that I never make. I got it very nicely, thanks to the racing line. Which is very oh, aesthetically unappealing. In an Italian shed, as Wait, I wonder whether I wonder shed. whether racing line takes me through this magnificent <laughs> crossing. Right, it does this, and then it goes left. Right, well, I'm just going this way. Right, we have a race on our hands, but not for very long because I'm going to inevitably overtake you. Depends if you have as much trouble with oversteer as certain other Ferraris. Wow. This... Um, oh! The tractors felt inspired by their heritage and decided to go off-roading. Well, yours is a tractor. Mine is only a tractor in Formula 1 sometimes. And sometimes it isn't. Yes. Although tractors are admittedly oh, no. oh, more no. reliable than most Ferraris. 
Especially in the F1. Oh! You I may have slightly killed both of us. Alright. That was an expensive accident. Yes, that was the world's most expensive accident. What an excellent title for clickbait. Goodbye, Petrol. Uh, it would appear the Ferraris won something, which it was unable to do in Canada. Your car has very nice wheels. Is it? No. Oh. Not especially. <laughs> you can't say much, let's be honest, they look ridiculous. Yes, but have you never wanted carbon fibre blades on your wheels? Well, yes, but not ones that look stupid. What is that sudden oversteer being produced by your... Are you all-wheel drive? Yes. You're going to dominate this track. What, why are you going that way? I thought we decided that's not actually a good idea because there's sticky it's out walls. It's not, because there's walls. Right, I'm going to go flying quickly because it's fun. Let's not get as stuck as I did last time I tried this. Oh, God! <laughs> spun out. Oh, I've spun out again. I've saved it. I'm sure that balloon was supposed to be pink. Well, it's white now. Never mind. It's almost as ridiculous as naming a car after the founder of the company that produces it. Ow! Well, it's slightly less ridiculous than naming it after a bull. Yeah, but can you imagine if Ow! Porsche called their car the Ferdinand? If who? If, oh, if Porsche called it the Ferdinand? <laughs> yes. Imagine if Lotus made the Vicolin. <laughs> that would be brilliant. This car is so nice to drive. It's definitely worth the 2.7... Actually, it's not. It's worth about 600 grand at most. <laughs> Surely a Ferrari F8 Tributo would drive better than that. But it is one of the ugliest Lamborghinis ever made. That is true. Why does he have to get the launch out? Why does the final... No! Not this again! Ow! I did actually gain quite a bit. 52 fives on the best lap time. I don't think that shows it though. That is three seconds faster than mine. Is it? Oh. <laughs> and I could have had less, Thanks. I think. What's the justification? Race cars are expensive. These cars are expensive. Therefore, these cars are race cars. Petrol Raceway. Night. Why is my car floating? Um. It's not as good as the AI that's sometimes loading upside down. That happens? Then why the hell is there no AI? That would have been amazing. I, I think I switched it off. No. Right. The PI deficit is sort of made up for by the fact I have no idea what I'm doing and you do. Ooh, welcome to Forza where we don't need objects that snap. Why does this feel like a 2004 video Just game? Be impressed with how flat the floor is, okay? It's not. <laughs> it's not sending you to space. <laughs> oh! But it's not wheelchair friendly either. No, but it's not quite Night Fury Suzuka. <laughs> how long did this take you, mate? Too long. Oh, five laps, right? Oh yeah, there's a compulsory pit stop. Is there? How does that work? Drive into the pit lane and stop for five Oh, that's what you mean by checkpoint, miss. No! Yes. <laughs> so you have to be much speed. Yes. That Ow! Was of death. I died. So where is this jump? I haven't found it yet. Or is it just all of these? The final corner and the hill at the beginning. Loop of, yeah, I'm in an infinite loop of being too slow. 
<laughs> Sometimes happens. Look, Thank I you tried for this in any the... class the other day, and I had to reverse to the other end of the straight to get the oh, checkpoint. God. <laughs> Would you mind slowing down? <laughs> I guess I should really test these every five minutes so that I don't waste any more time building them. <laughs> You spend an number of hours building it, and then that happens. Oh, Wait, can I just, just smash through it? Oh, no, I can't. No, I thought of that. <laughs> <laughs> when designing a track, I always think, where would Elf take liberties with corner cutting? <laughs> Full sand down the pit lane. Pit straight. Oh. Oh, no! That's an interesting way to die. I got Forza walled whilst vertical. This is very interesting. But at some point you just can go through because it gives up. Petrol built the track. Do I just say it's his own fault and keep driving there? <laughs> yes. Oh, you... You know how when you first open create a route, there's like yeah. a bit of racing line already on the ground? Yeah. If you don't follow that exactly when you come round for the end of the lap, it gets confused. That's ridiculous. So I just didn't make the straight long and straight enough. <laughs> Thank you, Forza, for being, well, yourself. Anyway, now I've figured that out, all tracks will be excellent. Oh, that was close! You appear to have won another challenge. It was music. Oh, I'm inside your car. It's interesting to see how much effort they put into the interior details of vehicles. Wow. I didn't place that tyre wall very well, did I? This isn't going very well for petrol, as it is currently 2-1 to one to the Ferrari. Which means it's time for a drag race to determine which is the ultimate most expensive car. Actually, petrol, let's not do a drag race. Colonial Let's Dirt do NASCAR. Colonial Dirt NASCAR. Oh, I realised a thing the other day. What? I think Colonial means American. I think it does. But American isn't Colonial so is anymore. NASCAR. No. Anyway. No, Colonial NASCAR. Okay. No, it isn't Colonial anymore. It's only Colonial if it's part one of the colonies. Surely. Yes, that's a good. Mm. Because the colonies drive this way around. We're just going to keep calling it Colonial NASCAR and let people fight out in the comments if we ever get some subscribers. Please let us know whether Colonial means clockwise or anti-clockwise. Two laps. In three. Two. One. Go! Wow, I've just remembered. This is completely stupid. I'm rear-wheel drive. Why exactly. is there... Foliage on the racetrack. This one's a lot more bumpy than the other one. Excellent. I'm sideways constantly, it's ridiculous. Or maybe it just feels that way because of the camber. I'm gonna make a blueprint that just goes around this, and then we can use it in the DRS. <laughs> Wait, no, 50 laps wouldn't be enough, would it? No. One! <laughs> This is where throttle control matters, unless you're in an all-wheel drive car. I may have accidentally done a bit of harvesting, then... Ooh. I've got to rent you a combined crop, harvester. Of battery energy. Oh. What sort of crop have you been harvesting, Petrol? I don't know. Whatever they're growing there. Is it time to claim free laps is what we actually said? Way! I know, I went... Mm. Possibly. Not sure it makes much difference. Three, two, one, go. Petrol has the launch, obviously. He's in the all-wheel drive car. But here comes the Enzo. And there goes the Ferrari from four years earlier. No, yes. At least four years earlier, depending on our facts. Oh! Why did I go through you when you weren't ghosted? You didn't on my end. 
How is that 0.58 meters, Forza? <laughs> Probably because he hit me. Um, oh, right, it was 0.5 meters to the roof of the Ferrari I landed on. <laughs> oh, ow. Well, I think we can conclude that the more expensive car is the better car. Yes. Which would you rather have? You're not allowed to resell it. Lamborghini. I'd actually have a Ferrari. Oh. Because no one said my friends aren't allowed to resell it and give me the money. And on that note, I do hope you enjoyed. If you did, do consider liking and or subscribing to both channels. Check out Purple Petrols for his point of view and other racing game content. If you have any suggestions for future challenges, please put them in the comment down below so that we may have some ideas for the future. Other than that, have a nice day. Goodbye.